Hello grade 9 math class, welcome back to another lesson. We are going to do number 2 today of this unit, where we are going to do the opposite of what we did in the first uh, lesson, and we're going to plot points uh, on a graph when we're given the coordinates. You might be able to see the faint line of a graph I've already drawn on the next page. Let's reveal, oh yes, okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the points that are given uh, in your booklet and on the screen here, and we're going to plot them and label them, hopefully, let's see, yeah, with a really fine, the finest point red marker I currently have. Will it stay that way? No, but let's do this. So our first point is E, and it is the point three minus one. So three minus one, we would go over to the right three. So one, two, three, and we're gonna go down one for the minus one. So that is going to be this point right about there. And we're going to label that as best we can E. Oh yeah, that looks really good. Okay, this won't look that good for long, but we'll give it a go. The next point we want to label is F. So we are going to do four to the right and two up. Positive four and positive two. One, two, three, four. One, two, that is about there. And we're gonna label that point F. So I always do uh, left to right first, and then up and down. The x value first, and then the y value. G is minus 3, 2. So I'm going to go 1, 2, 3 to the left for the minus 3, and then up 2. 1, 2. Right about there. And that is the point G. Make sure you label them clearly. Point G, point E, point F. Let's do H. So one, two, three, four, five to the right and down one, plus five and then minus one. That is point H. I is three, four. Okay, we're loading up this right side. One, two, three to the right and then four up. So that's there-ish. There-ish, that's why I'm making the point so big. And we're gonna label that point I. Mm -hmm. Might not be right above three, but that's okay. We'll do our next one, J. J is minus three and five. So one, two, three to the left, and then up five all the way to the top. That's right about there, we're gonna call it. And I said that was point J. Very nice. Let's do K, minus five and two. So one, two, three, four, five to the left for the minus five. And then the second part is plus two, so it's gonna go up two. So that's right here. And I said that that was point K. L is minus one, so left one, and then minus four, down four, so that's over here. And go ahead and label that as point L. Point M is two, one, so one, two to the right and one up. Positive two, positive one, that is point M. And then point N is one and then four, so one to the right and four up. One for an X value and four for a Y value. So we just do this methodically, we do the X value left and right, the Y value up and down, we go ahead and we plot that point and we label it, okay? Let's go ahead. And do the other problems that you have. Other problem that you have. All right. Well, we can see them all here. You don't need to see the graph because you're probably plotting them yourself, and I'm plotting them up here. B is minus five and then zero. So five to the left and then point zero. So that's right there on the axis. It goes zero up and down. That's point B. Point C is two, one. So that's two to the right and one up. D is plus five and plus three. So that's five to the right, one, two, three, four, five, and three up to about there. So that is point D. So remember, when we have our brackets, it's the, y value, or the x value first and the y value second, x and then y. So this is side to side and then up and down. E is five to the right and four up, so that's just one single unit above D. We have F, which is two to the right and five down. 
we have G, which is four to the right, one, two, three, four, and three up. One unit to the left of D. H is minus one, minus two. So one to the left and then two down. That is H, I said. Plus three and minus five for I. So one, two, three to the right and then down five. These are all unique points unless they are exactly the same coordinates. Three to the right and one down for J, plus three and minus one. And then for K, minus three and plus one. So one, two, three to the left and then up one. Okay, if you have questions about this, please let me know. We are just working back and forth, doing X value and then the Y value, plotting the point and moving from there. Um, thank you so much for watching everybody. I'll see you in class.